What's going on guys, I'm back with another video. Anyway, we've seen several major celebrities appearing in photo shoots, where they symbolically pledge allegiance to the occult elite. Far from being subtle, the symbols are clear, unmistakable, and repeated throughout mass media. Lil Nas X is a perfect example. Lil Nas X is currently a chosen celebrity, which means that mass media is intensely shining its proverbial spotlight on him. The result is, he's all over magazines, award shows, and he's trending on any platform you can imagine. The only reason why he's is being promoted is, he's a celebrity that was manufactured to push specific agendas. To announce the coming of his new album Montero, which was promoted with a highly satanic music video, Lil Nas X had a pregnancy shoot. As seen in previous video about him, there's a clear yet fantastic agenda of depicting pregnant men in mass media. As seen in previous videos, Lil Nas X works are also permeated with mind control symbolism. His album cover is all about butterflies, representing monarch programming, and him floating, representing dissociation. In one of his promo pics, Lil Nas X stands naked, holding his thing with butterfly wings on his back. The perfect way of representing an industry slave. Before I continue the video, please give a like if you've learned something. And, don't forget to subscribe, and also, click the notification bell too, so you won't miss any update. And, watch to the end, to avoid misunderstanding. Thank you. Not long ago, I also described Billie Eilish as a chosen celebrity. While well, everything about her has always been symbolic, things are clearly being taken to another notch. After the Met Gala, Eilish posted this picture of her in a revealing red dress, color of initiation in the occult elite. Her entire look channeled Marilyn Monroe, the prototypical industry slave. Most young female celebrities have to channel Marilyn at one point or another in their career. To make sure you understand this about industry slavery, the caption of this photo is, a butterfly. Of course, as an industry slave, Eilish has to constantly show the one-eye sign. In this Elle magazine photo shoot, her hair was strategically placed to hide an eye. Industry slave Selena Gomez also had to channel Marilyn in a recent photo shoot. Bonus. A one-eye sign using strategically placed hair. Here, Courtney Stodden is dressed as Marilyn Monroe, the ultimate product of kitten programming. As we've seen, almost all celebrities associated with kitten programming dress up as Monroe at one point or another in their career. Iris Law, the daughter of actor Jude Law, is becoming a celebrity model. And, as expected, the symbolism surrounding her also indicates that she's also becoming an industry slave. Chained, tied up, creepy double eyes, and devil horns on her head. Pure industry slave symbolism. Here, still with horns on her hand, Law does the one-eye sign using a spoon. Creative genius. I'm not gonna lie. Tilda Swinton creeps the hell out of me. Her photo shoot for W Magazine fully exploits that creepiness, and even takes it to another level, as it is permeated with MK occult elite symbolism. Here, Tilda is oddly standing next to Birdcage, symbol used to represent monarch slaves. She apparently caught the bird herself. Why Tilda? Why? Let the bird fly. While this pick alone might not be MK related, the combination of this image with the others reads as a cult elite mind control 101. This image is all about the occult concept of duality, represented by the checkerboard pattern ceremonial floors. The pattern is found on the floor of this picture, and Tilda is literally draped in it. The setting also includes religious spiritual items, giving the shot an ethereal feel. Here, Tilda goes all one-eyed occult elite with it. The images she is holding of an eye and a mouth appear to be of a different person, 
hinting to the concept of programmed alter personality and mind control. You see what you are programmed to see, and say what you are programmed to say. Two tildes, separated by a fracture of the image, represent the fracturing of a MK slave's psyche into alter personas. This Vogue Italia photo shoot is also all about with monarch programming symbolism. Here, we see the concept of multiple personas. Silenced by a butterfly, monarch programming. Blinded by a butterfly, monarch programming. Mickey Mouse ears are codes in the entertainment industry, representing MK mind control. Here's Rita Ora on the cover of Elle, wearing gigantic ears. This photo shoot in Vestal, appropriately named Pop Queen, is all about Mickey Mouse programming. On the left, the Pop Queen wears a variety of occult symbols, including an inverted pentagram, symbol of black magic, and an inverted cross. On the right, Mickey Mouse ears. Yup, that's the crap you need to do and wear to be a Pop Queen. As usual, the one-eye sign was all over mass media, clearly indicating who is owned by the occult elite. The Guardian recently launched a new magazine, and the cover of its first issue could not be more symbolic. Greta Thunberg, the media-manufactured climate activist, has one eye hidden by an oily substance that probably represents pollution. For the one-eye sign, they are clearly telling you that she is a pawn being used to push a specific agenda. Yet most people do not see it. A fake tear. How appropriate. Greta has been displaying the one-eye sign since the very start of her career, as exemplified by this 2019 ID magazine photo shoot. This Instagram post by Nicole Kidman is MK101. A one-eye sign, monarch butterflies everywhere, and eyes on her shirt. She knows about all of this stuff. Her father was deep into the occult elite madness. The poster of the movie Last Duel has Matt Damon doing the one-eye sign. And Adam Driver. The promotional poster of the British series Wolfie is just the main character giving you a one-eye sign. The message is, the series will most likely contain elite agenda garbage. A pop rapper Lisa, formerly of the group Blackpink, has been dominating charts in Korea and is crossing over the United States. The big fat one eye sign on the cover art of her album, Lalissa, explains the reason behind the success. In the past, I've made a video about Poppy because she's all about occult elite and MK symbolism. Her recent collaboration with the Japanese brand Qpot could not be more blatant. This ad combines the one eye sign, using an eye patch, so clever, eyeballs everywhere atop a creepy image of internal organs. Another one eye sign combined with brains, mind control. This image is pure MK Ultra. Poppy's brain is separated from her head and placed on a plate. The butterfly on the brain indicates that this is all about monarch programming. Furthermore, this image refers to cannibalism, one of the elite's favorite obsessions. This is the last photo in this video. They are the people at the Emmy Awards. Is there anything weird? Please put your answer in the comments section. Comment below with more topic ideas for me to discuss. As a lot of care and hard work goes into this, likes and subscribe, let me know I'm doing a good job. All is appreciated greatly. You may not agree with everything from the content I post. Apply critical thinking and use discernment to come to your own conclusions regarding the content. Thanks for watching this video. This Everything Inside Me channel, see you on the next video. Stay safe and healthy.